I'm Jennifer. I'm a boot here at Wheaton Labs, and we are about to run the rocket water heater so we can take some hot showers. One lot of wood in. Um, I'm gonna wait about 10 minutes, come back, fill it up with wood again, um, and then once that's completely burned out, we'll have 40 gallons of hot water. This rocket powered, pressurized water heater is the result of many layers of innovation and overhaul. It was most recently rebuilt during the 2019 Appropriate Technology course here at Wheaton Labs to include a lengthened and insulated heat riser as well as a taller insulated chimney. This raises the temperature of the burn and speeds up the flow through the entire system. Since these additions, it has become easier to light, more efficient, and the water heats up a bit faster. A thermostatic mixing valve was also recently added to the hot water outlet to make sure that we don't send anything hotter than 110 degrees Fahrenheit into the showers. Keep in mind that this is a pressurized system and the most critical part is a pressure blow-off valve to prevent overpressurization and a boiling explosion of the hot water tank. We've learned through experience that burning more than two lots of firewood will result in a test of the pressure release valve. From starting the fire to taking a hot shower takes about 45 minutes. Five minutes to light and 40 minutes to burn. It provides enough hot water from one burn for about six hot, luxurious showers. If you have more than six people in line at the end of the day, you can keep adding wood as the showers are taken. If you don't use it all immediately, don't worry, it will still be hot the next morning for those sunrise shower takers. If you like this sort of thing, come on out to the forums at permies.com, where we talk about rocket water heaters, homesteading, and permaculture all the time. <laughs>